I think most of us have access to a first aid kit of one kind or another. And maybe our first aid kit could have more in it uh, for a, an emergency. I want to mention one thing that you should consider at least having as a part of your personal first aid kit or the first aid kit that you have for your family. When I was growing up, my dad used to carry an EpiPen for uh, possible use if he was exposed to shellfish because he has a, a, a bad shellfish allergy that could kill him. And we thought that was very normal to have an EpiPen available. Naloxone should be thought of as a life-saving preventative medication in the case of opioid overdose. And could be considered to be part of a family's or a personal first aid kit. And I wanna talk a little bit about naloxone and its efficacy in preventing an op opioid overdose. People sometimes think of overdose as something that you do if you're purposefully trying to overdose or if you're not taking medication appropriately or you're using medication that you shouldn't be taking. Recognize that not all overdoses occur because of misuse or overuse. Patients can overdose on opioids, taking them precisely as prescribed. They can overdose on opioids when they have been on the same dose for years and haven't increased their dose. There's a lot of factors that play a role in overdose. You could take another medication that changes the opioid level. You could come off of a medication that changes your opioid level. You could take grapefruit juice or St. John's wort or a variety of other supplements or foods, food items that could change the opioid level. So anyone that is taking an opioid should consider having naloxone available in the case of overdose. And by the way, you may not be the one that overdoses on an opioid if you have been prescribed an opioid. It could be somebody in your home, somebody that accidentally found access to the opioid, such as a child that may not even know what they are getting into. The current recommendations are that all patients that have opioids in the home should consider having naloxone readily available. Fortunately, in most cases, it's either free to access or it requires a inexpensive copay. Insurance companies are even considering offering it without a copay because of its potential life-saving benefits. So consider having a first aid kit. Consider as a part of your first aid kit in your home having naloxone readily available.